hello and welcome back this is madan today i'm going to show you an example of how to perform sql injection in the application that doesn't use parameterized query so on the screen you can see the application so first of all i'm going to walk you through the application so here we have a login page and uh, we can't access those link without login so the, i have a username called matt and password one two three and if i log in then our application has successfully logged in now we can visit home employees and privacy and employee we have these several data here and we can add new employee from here or cancel it and uh, let's uh, briefly look through the code so the main part here is i have a user uh, i have a user repository here and this user repository tries to authenticate the user and it doesn't use parameterized query so it is simple plain sql query and no parameters no it is not parameterized here and the another repository is employee repository and in order to create the employee here i have used the here also i have used the plain sql query and uh, no parameterized and uh, to get all employees same thing here so i have used the plain is sql query so this type of plain sql query are under high risk uh, from the sql injection uh, attack point of view so now let's uh, end uh, here talking about the code we have an employee repository and this is a normal uh, employee controller this is a normal controller that uh, takes data from the repository and pass that to the view and we have a user controller and here we have login and logout method so let's uh, uh, see the demo of sql injection and how we can log in without knowing username and password so let's log out now if i go over then i cannot access the link but now i want you to look uh, on the i want you to look what i type very carefully here so i type anything so i don't know any username and then what i do is exclamation and then i put or here and then i put a boolean true condition so one equal to one is true in case of sql query and then i comment dash dash means the comment in sql so what it will does is uh, it will pass this value and then close the code and put another condition here or one equal to one and this makes the whole statement true and dash dash comments the rest of the sql command and uh, i'm just going to put anything in the password so the password here is one two three for the user matt so let's log in and see if we can successfully log in or not so this is an example of sql injection login and here we go so this is our username now we can navigate to the home employee and we see the record here and then we can so without knowing username and password also we can log in to the application that doesn't use parameterized query and believe me there are a whole lot of applications even today that doesn't use parameterized query so let's see another demo here so uh, we have a search field here and uh, the malicious user can put sql injection through this field as well so if i press 2 then what it does it it search for the employee with which word full name contains the word 2 so let's search all and now i'm going to try to delete uh, uh, all the records or uh, the employee with whose id is 6 so for that what i'm gonna do is i put anything here and then close that and then terminate that sql command and then i put another sql command here delete from let's say i guess the name of the table as employees because this is an employee and uh, let's say that the table could be the employee there is a uh, probable case that we could uh, uh, guess the name of the table uh, by doing several <coughs> hit and trial so let's i am putting the name of the table as employee although i know it it is employee so delete from em employes employees where id equal to six and then i terminate this and then comment the rest of the command and i put the source here so now let's click on all then we have all the records except the record with the id 6 so this is the demo of sql injection and if you like this video then please uh, subscribe share 
to other friends as well so thanks for watching and have a great day